Good evening, my dear NEET 2025 warriors. This is your captain, your captain Shreyas, your physics teacher on the number one NEET English channel. And there is a breaking announcement and in fact, the most awaited, awaited news. Like I had mentioned before also, you didn't have to waste your time searching for when registration will be out. I had already told you it will be January end or by mid of February. And that's exactly what has happened. So, the news is NTA has officially begun the registration for the NEET 2025 UG entrance examination. As you can see, this is that link. Let's go step by step. I'm going to help you decode the entire brochure. Yes, the brochure is also out. And please, for God's sake, please don't fill the application form right now. Yes, you might be surprised why sir is saying so. Because the reason is there are so many things and so many mistakes you can make. And once you make a mistake, unnecessarily you will be wasting money, time, everything. And you don't want to lose an year because you filled it in a wrong way. That's exactly what happened with many JE students. Immediately they pounce. Nothing is going to happen. Wait for two, three days. We will also make videos on how to fill the form and only then please fill the form. First of all, smash the like button in case you have not yet subscribed. Please subscribe and like this video because that way you will get all the updates and relevant information. So once you click on this link, this particular notice will open up. Online application for the NEET UG entrance examination. Okay. The NEET UG will be conducted uh, for all the medical institutions, BDS, etc. Uh, Ayurveda, uh, veterinary etc okay and all the other disciplines okay this is all standard nursing everything exam will be held 4th may as predicted 4th may 180 minutes please note that it is not 3 hour 20 minutes it is exactly 3 hours 2 o'clock to 5 o'clock so please note this time this is the time which is going to decide your future 2 o'clock to 5 o'clock 4th may that is the day the application form begins today, 7th February to 7th March. Yes, 7th February to 7th March. Everyone, I hope I am audible and visible to all of you. Please let me know very quickly. Yes, 7th May to 7th of March. So there is good one month of time. All right. Thank you for liking the video also. Thank you so much. I was just checking the likes. Thank you. Okay, next. There are multiple ways by which you can pay credit, debit, net banking and even UPI. There is a correction window which will open after 7th March from 9th to 11th. Now, don't think all the details can be corrected. Only few details. But please don't take chances. If by mistake your father's name, your name, address, this, that is wrong you are gone then and it is not allowed to be corrected. Your year will be wasted. So please don't do that. Okay. So be very careful. So the fee is 1,700 for general and for other categories, it is 1,600, 1,000 and outside India, it is 9,500. Okay. Uh, city intimation. This is also very important. Which city will your exam center be? Will come on 26th of April. The date of exam. Okay. Admit card will come on the website on 1st May, just 4 to 3 days before the exam, 1st May, you will get to know which city. Why? Because if you are staying in some distant town and village, 26th April, at least you can book a bus, train, whatever, at least some 8-10 days before. 1st May, admit card will come. Duration of exam, etc. is as standard. And uh, candidates can apply through online mode only. Submission is this, this, this. Now, this is very important, guys. Please listen to me very carefully. Only one application has to be submitted by one candidate. You might think, let me apply two, three times and see. No, if you do that, they will, they have all the rights to cancel all the forms. So, please, please, please do not register multiple times. Whatever you fill, fill it once, fill it properly. Also, they should follow the strict inf information and instructions given on the bulletin. That though you will. But anyways, this is very important. Email address and mobile number should be yours, should be unique. Don't give some email ID which whose password you have forgotten. I have seen many students 
who think that okay my email address i know they give that email id and suddenly they remember oh my god i forgot the password i don't know what the password is so first login inside your email see whether you are getting mails are you remembering the password don't auto login remember that password just in case okay write it down mobile number don't give random mobiles your mobile if you don't have a mobile give your mom dad's brother sister's mobile that's okay but all otps all information correction window everything all information will come on that mobile so please don't change that mobile for the next 5 6 months at least provide that mobile number only email id also should be that unique is this absolutely clear yes good evening everyone okay now let's open the main document now where is that main document see go down over here do you see this link candidate activity can you see this link click on this particular link the moment you click on this particular link it will basically open up this this particular page how to apply online already existing candidate register your profile first of all you have to create your profile over here now examination cities is mentioned this is a list of examination cities most of your cities will be here but if you want to you can just check yes yes you can check let's say i am from andhra okay okay i am i i want to write it in english multiple options okay you can enter the captcha and you can see which all uh, examination centers are there all right then information bulletin that is what we are going to see now this is that information bulletin will come to that all right apply for the registration fill the form pay the fee download the confirmation page before going there you have to click on new registration and this new registration will open up this particular window everybody can see this this is your new registration you have to create your profile you cannot log in right because you are new now don't say sir i am a dropper can i use last year's data no you can't use last year's data please don't say all such things you cannot say already existing candidate say register your profile new registration okay sir now what and all is there see please download the information bulletin carefully only after that fill the form without that don't fill application of uh, fees are given over here uh, there are three steps first is registration second is completing the form third is third is third is selecting the payment option and paying it that's all you will be generating a password when you create your profile please for god's sake remember that password i know you can say forgot password but again why create an issue please remember that password don't have to be a hero in non remembering now what all things will be needed while you fill the form that is mentioned a recent passport photograph color and black and white okay 80% face coverage without mask ears to be visible ears to be visible with white plain background white background only the face 80% coverage ears to be visible don't wear some fancy things here don't have some weird hairstyle probably some of you will be like sir i wear specs that's okay sir what if i might get specs that's also okay sir today i don't have beard but during the exam i'm going to keep beard okay so click a photo with approximately whatever beard you are going to have okay don't have to be exact same style so same style is needed no no don't do all such things roughly give or take it should be similar signature will be needed and you have to upload it in jpg or jpeg form with 10 to 50 kb sir i clicked a photo sir but my but my size is very big sir my size is a very big of that photograph what to do sir there are many online tools just search for image size converter image size image sizer resizer so many online tools are there just click on any one of them select your image and it will automatically downsize it okay it will automatically downsize it is it clear many tools are there online then your photo with the name okay again in 10 kb to 200 kb 
लेफ्ट हैंड राइट हैंड थम इंप्रेशन विल बी नीडेड इन जेपेग फॉर्मेट लेफ्ट हैंड यू टेक इंक रबर स्टैम्प एंड यू हैव टू प्रेस इट ऑन अ व्हाइट पेपर यू हैव टू टेक अ फोटो एंड देन अपलोड इट ओके ऑल राइट देन स्कैंड कॉपी ऑफ द कैटेगरी सर्टिफिकेट category certificate if applicable not for everyone scanned copy of 10th or equivalent mark sheet scanned copy okay of your mark sheet that is done identity proof now identity proof we will remember for those candidates who will verify their identities through methods other than aadhar card or digi locker should be named as something else as per that name of that id card preferably please give id card as aadhar please give aadhar as your id okay you can also use the digi locker option it is not mandatory it is optional pwd candidate certificate needed address proof needed okay address proof can be as on your aadhar or maybe your driving license whatever you are using lastly for nri oci candidates that particular certificate of citizenship is also needed as a scanned copy for everything there is a size 500 to 300 i cannot buy heart it every time i click a photo i will check its size i will downsize it or accordingly i will resize it so that it will be uploaded or else you will not be allowed to upload it till this point is everybody clear just give me a thumbs up okay then you go to this then you go to this information brochure everything is given over here everything is given over here all right okay all the things are given over here as you can see same things what i told you over here as well result will be declared on 14th june approximately approximately okay you can see that registration form application form all the sizes what are the documents are needed fee payment all right all these things instructions are given start reading it more than your ncert right now you need to read this now what happens is over here uh, you will also see the uh, syllabus and other things also and how the admission will happen everything it's a very big, big very 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 big document okay and towards the end they will have some screenshots also if i'm not wrong yes they will have some screenshots also of uh, how to fill the form yeah see they have taken screenshots okay you have to go here then go here okay then go here then go here how the form will look like every screenshot has been given over here so that when you look at the screenshot you will get the confidence okay this is how i have to fill the particular form but don't worry we will also help you fill the form we'll probably create a dummy id and try to help you create this particular uh, application form as well okay now regarding paper difficulty regarding timing strategy i know i have promised a timing strategy video i will do that also and every other detail i will keep you guys posted so stay tuned on this particular channel lot of things are coming so please subscribe and please like this video because lots and lots of information will come you do not want to miss any single piece of information because that will decide how you are going to write the exam if you are going to write the exam and of course lot of important strategies and academic videos coming very soon bye bye captain shreyas signing off Hasta la vista.